Japanese Defense Minister Itsunori Onodera recently paid his first visit to Camp Zama to tour the installation and meet with Lieutenant General Masahiro Hidaka, commander of the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force's Central Readiness Force, for the first time since its relocation to the U.S. Army installation. During his visit, Onodera attended an office call with Lieutenant General Hidaka and his staff, and Colonel Kenneth Chase, Deputy Commander of U.S. Army Japan, before receiving a briefing on the comprehensive capabilities of both the CRF and USERJ. Onodera also toured historical monuments on the installation and saw the Sobodai He and other U.S.-Japan friendship monuments, as well as the air raid shelter built for former Emperor Hirohito. I think the relationship between the U.S. and Japanese forces has always been great, but it continues to become stronger today because we both have a clear understanding of each other's organizational roles and responsibilities. In particular, the relationship between U.S. Army Japan and the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force has increased both of their capabilities following the Central Readiness Force's relocation from Osaka, Tokyo to Kamazama. This relocation benefited both the U.S. and Japan and allows them to work closely and more efficiently. Reporting for U.S. Army Garrison Japan, this is Dustin Perry.